Welcome back to Pork Sips and Parsimony. We are working on grapes. So for my birthday, Charity went to Ocean State and lo and behold, they had grapes. Now we already have a grape arbor. They are Concord grapes. And when we when we moved here, they were greatly overgrown and didn't really, you know, they've produced a little bit, but not a lot. And we have been wanting table grapes for a very long time and we found some so art and mary and, and peter are digging up a new spot for our grapes we're putting it on the back side of the garden so for, for reference here we've got the greenhouse and then we're going to just do a small arbor here with these two plants and hopefully it won't be this year usually they produce the second or third year so hopefully we will start having table grapes and because I have these I can start pruning them how I want them and not let them get overgrown. Do you tell the roots are? I think that's the whole root ball but I've got to read the instructions see wow. what they say. I think we have to soak them in a bucket of water. Plant. Okay, Wait, thanks. Time. perfect. Dip this one okay. In. Carefully take it out. You put this in too? Uh, it says, I think remove all. Place pan, in pail of water so roots are well soaked and all packing material is washed off. So, so I guess. You it. keep it on. I'm going to put it over here. So this is all wrapped up like, oh, there's the roots. This okay, see that? Okay, that's dirt. And there's the plant. See that? Yeah. So now we're going to soak that. Can you take off most of the dirt? Um, yeah, and we'll put it in the pot. Put it in the pot. Was this any of the roots? No, no. Soak that, it, soak that in there. There we go. Okay, you want to put that in here. Do you want to name the grapes, Mom? Should we name the grapes? Yeah. Henry and Mary? No. Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> Anna and Charlie. Yeah, that's good. I like it. Would Anna and Charlie. Anna and Sir Anna and Sir Sir Anna and Princess Char No. S Princess Princess Anna and Sir Charlie. How's that? Good. This one's Princess. This okay. Is. Okay, Art. Mm -hmm. Here is Sir Charlie uh -oh. and Princess Anna. Okay. We got them. Which one's uh oh, whoa, not much to it. No, no, that's, they told you to pull all the packing material off the roots. Oh, okay. That's, Just like that. That's princess okay. and that's so how well, you can plant them? Well, we're going to dig the holes and then we can plant them. We're going to see how these are doing in here. Oh, they look good. Look good. We have onions. No, yeah, okay. No, looking good. Weed. We'll pull the weed out. We don't need the weed. Tell them about the big we got and we got our onions looking good. Wow, it's working. Other than the weeds, liked it too. Uh oh, oh, it's leaves. okay. It's okay. We're gonna put the grapes there, honey. Yeah, I got that. I need to dig it up. I don't know if you guys can see it. But you have arbor. Okay, we have carrots here. Lots of carrots are coming up now. So that's good. Um, that looks like a javelin stick. Well, it's going to get a little shorter. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say that looks a little overkill. I'll go get my muffins. Mm -hmm. Good idea. But why doesn't it make a thing like that? <laughs> Look at this. Kale. Volunteer kale. I didn't plant any this year, but <laughs> it's coming up. Oh, I know that sound. <laughs> oh, someone needs mommy. You need mommy. Okay, honey. You I think can have she mommy. Doesn't like the break. <laughs>
dollars for this. <laughs> yeah, don't let the roots fall off. Yeah. Listen to that bluebird. I hear him. And we'll just fill it with mulch all around it. Right. Part of the reason I want to do this today or is we're supposed to get all that rain tomorrow. Yeah. This it's always is, nice they yeah. don't have to water the plants. The Absolutely. We'll have to water it probably towards the end of the week. Yeah. Because it's supposed to be really sunny. Okay, next one. This one's this one is Sir Charles. Is that its name? Yes, yeah, Sir Charles and Princess Anna. Name that. <laughs> it's a combination of mommy and Mary. Mary wanted to name them. So, I came up with Anna and Charles, and then we just put the Sir and, the Sir and Princess on it. Mm -hmm. And it's stuck, Art. Well, you think it will stick? We'll see. Depends on how often Mary comes out here and decides to talk to Sir Charles and Princess Anna. <laughs> that sand is what our garden used to be, yeah. and we have worked very hard trying to get it to, uh, <laughs> to not, be not be sandy. You can see how the soil looks different versus this. But we put good compost in there. We'll do compost probably every year for a couple years and put some mulch on top of it and these guys should do fine. Flood! So we decided we needed a second stick here for added reinforcement. We doubt the plants are going to get that tall this year, maybe next year. So this is all done. We're just going to get mulch to put mulch here and then pick up the sod. And one project complete. And it didn't even take an hour, Art. Wow, that's pretty good. Lightning I wish speed for us. Yeah. <laughs> it's been three weeks since we planted the grapes. And I wanted to give you a little bit of an update on how they're growing. This is our grape, and you can see it has no green leaves. Shortly after planting it, even though we kept it watered, this vine just literally shriveled up and died. So we don't know if this is gonna grow at all. I water it, it's really moist, but I don't know what's going to happen. So this was Sir Charles, Princess Anna, and they both look equally not so good. So I don't know, we're gonna continue watering them and see what happens, but it's not looking very promising. Now the variety that we ended up getting this year is just a green Thompson table grape. And this is what we've tried to grow every time. We have yet to have success. We bought two other grapes and put them up at our other building to grow there. And they did the same thing. I also did some research online and it seems that the green cable grapes just take a lot longer to get established and to grow and there were testimonials saying that it could take most of the summer for you to see any type of growth. So I don't know. I don't know what to think. I'm hoping we didn't lose them. I'm going to continue watering them and hope there's some growth. But it's not looking, I don't think it's looking all that hopeful right now. That being said, this is my Concord Grape Arbor. And as you can see, it's just starting to set leaves. And that is only on the new growth. The old canes, which is like what I just planted, aren't really doing anything. They don't look good. So this is obviously a growing cane, but you can, the old wood, you don't see any growth. It's only the new growth that you're seeing the leaves on. So I guess we're just going to have to wait and see what happens. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Thanks so much for watching. And if you guys have any experience growing the green table grapes and planting them, I would love to hear from you guys if you've had problems getting them established or if you think there's hope for mine or did I just kill my grapes that I bought. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. I hope you're having a fabulous May day and we'll see you for our next video. Bye.